Today, I'll show you how I made this alien where when you hold his hands, it glows different colours and makes sounds. I'm Michael Forrest and this is Leaving the Laptop, a series exploring ways to play live electronic music without using a laptop. There are three main parts to this project. First, I'll show you how to make the hands touch responsive. Then I'll show you what makes the chest glow. Finally, I'll show you how the audio works. Anything metal can become a capacitive touch sensor. Here I've wrapped some tin foil around this alien's hands. His name is... <coughs> On the Arduino, we need two controllers, one for each hand. We set up each with two sensor pins, an audio track number and a colour to glow. We'll store changing values in each controller. This is how our sketch looks. We set everything up and then in each loop, we check the sensor, raise or lower its gain and update its lights and sounds. I got this little ring where you can control the colour of each LED. First I thought it could be an Iron Man arc reactor, but instead I made a little backpack so it makes his body glow. In the code, we set up the ring, and then each loop we can set the pixel colour. Its brightness will be proportional to the current gain. I make every odd light glow white and every even light glow red. This is a WAV trigger. It plays samples from a micro SD card and supports serial control. I created a couple of samples on the computer, naming the files starting with the right numbers. The samples are basically always playing on a loop and we just control the volume. Now we just get out the glue gun and start gluing the heck out of things. I'll put links to any code or materials in the notes here and feel free to ask questions in the comments below. I'm trying to do a new video every month, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss the next one. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.